This is a highly practical seminar. It focuses on many uh, examples from the petrochemical and the process industry. The seminar starts off with rotating equipment and that includes pumps. We will be looking at uh, positive displacement and uh, dynamic pumps. We will be looking at pump characteristics including the head, the capacity, uh, power, um, efficiency and uh, what we call the net positive suction head. Um, after that we go straight into compressors. Again we're going to divide it into uh, dynamic compressors and positive displacement ones. Again, we're going to treat it in a very similar uh, fashion to the way we treated the pumps. Uh, we will be talking about some components related to that, things like mechanical seals, things like bearings, again, to complement these uh, uh, two types of uh, rotating um, equipment. Um, obviously, we need to drive them using some sort of a drive, and this is where the course takes us to uh, motors, in particular, the, um, the AC induction motor. Again, we're going to be looking at characteristics, uh, the different types of motors, uh, the enclosures, the way the motor operates with these pumps and compressors, how you can size it. Um, so the, all these uh, topics will be combined together. Uh, then obviously the motor needs to be, um, um, in this case, controlled and this is where the uh, variable frequency drives come in. So we'll be talking about the ways uh, a variable frequency drive is used to uh, monitor and actually control the speed of these particular uh, rotating equipment so then we can deal with various capacities um, and demand uh, requirements. Um, again, we will be uh, then looking at some static equipments and that mainly includes valves. So the types of valves that we were looking for uh, that we'll be looking for are things like uh, control valves, things like a ball valve, a globe valve and so on and so forth. We'll be looking at uh, non-return valves or check valves if you like and then uh, we will follow that by pressure relief valves. So we have a very good uh, way of looking at these, uh, at these valves. Obviously we need to control the valves so this is where we talk about actuators in this case. So we've got a full uh, if you like, program of study going from rotating equipment to, uh, to pumps, to valves, to compressors and to variable frequency drives. Uh, we need to look at some of the problems that these uh, equipment may face and this is where we look at um, condition monitoring. So we'll be looking at the vibration characteristics of uh, rotating equipment. We'll be looking at uh, analyzing what we call the spectrum and then from that we can then define the various problems that these particular equipments encounter and ways and means of, uh, of, of, uh, of dealing with them. Uh, and at last we end up with uh, the last topic which is about uh, bid evaluation. This is where, for example, we look at different types of equipment uh, and we're looking at the various characteristics that are required. We will be looking at how you price them and how from that you can choose uh, the actual best uh, piece of equipment to do a particular job. And as I said, this whole course will be complemented by uh, real examples. The, uh, um, the delegates will be asked to, uh, to discuss uh, various issues that they have that they can bring in from their uh, place of work. Uh, we will be again complementing the information using uh, videos and using uh, various computer uh, programs in order to explain the various concepts. Uh, thank you very much. That concludes this particular um, seminar.